Edsel Roundup. The Edsel Roundup is a station wagon that was produced and sold by Edsel in 1958. Like the Villager and Bermuda station wagons, the Roundup was built on a 116-inch 2946mm wheelbase shared with Ford's station wagons as well as core body stampings. It had an approach angle of 21 deck and an overall length of 205.42 in. The Roundup represented the base trim level available within the Edsel to further separate the Roundup from the Ford Ranch wagon on which it was based. The Roundup received Edsel's front fascia and grill assembly, as well as unique boomerang-shaped taillights. The shape of the taillights posed a problem when used as turn indicators, the left-hand taillight appeared as an arrow pointing right and vice versa from a distance. All station wagons shared the Edsel Ranger's engine availability, with a 361 cubic inch VAT as standard, as was a three-speed manual transmission. Buyers also had the option of a three-speed automatic transmission with a standard column mounted gear selector, or could choose Edsel's highly promoted but trouble-prone teletouch automatic, which placed its drive selection buttons in the steering wheel hub. While their rollout was highly publicized in the fall of 1957, Edsel's were a marketing disaster for Ford. Total output for the Roundup stood at 963 units. The low output number could be attributed to the declining popularity of two-door wagons in the American market and the Edsel's overall lack of consumer appeal. For the 1959 model year, the Roundup and the premium Bermuda station wagons were dropped, leaving the mid-value Villager as Edsel's sole station wagon model.